The world is taking notice of what's happening at the Port of Long Beach. Recently, Tokyo Electric Power Company sent a representative to learn about the port's state-of-the-art cold ironing or short-of-ship power installations, which help dramatically reduce pollution by allowing ships to shut down their engines while at berth. Japanese ports are looking to follow suit as the demand for environmental protection there grows. We, we regard the Port of Long Beach uh, is, the, uh, is a kind of a leader in the world. We wanted to learn from the experience of the leader. The ships come here and they also go to many other countries and now we have an international standard. They want to make sure that they comply with those standards. The information will be uh, very useful. Currently, three Port of Long Beach terminals are equipped with shore power, and $65 million is being invested to power up all of its container terminals by the end of 2013. What surprised me most is uh, their organized way. The Port Authority and tenants and the ship owners are working together in close relationship. It's hard to have construction crews and a vessel alongside at the same time, so we have to plan that uh, very uh, well together with the construction crews. And that's where a lot of the cooperation comes in between the terminal operators, the designers, and the contractors in trying to coordinate the work. It's a challenging coordination, communication, but it's one that we've been able to successfully manage. For more information on the port's shore power initiatives, please visit polb.com.